Hey guys, Sock here from Sock e Tech, and in today's video, I'm going to talk about a brand new update to the GoodLock application that brings up a new interesting feature to the table. So let's dive in and get started. So first, let me show you what I'm talking about, and then I'm going to show you how to enable it, all right? So basically, uh, with this new update, you can activate a touchpad on the actual screen. So what you do is, in my case, I set it up so it appears when I swipe from the right to the left. So I'm going to do that right now. And then now I have a little touchpad on the screen. Now that's the actual trackpad that moves with your finger. And that's the pointer over where, we, where you can click on stuff. So if I were to bring it right over here uh, to the weather, and if I tap it, it's going to launch that weather application. All right. Now if it disappears if you don't touch the screen. So you bring it back just like that. Now if I were to go over to Twitter, and if I tap on this one, it would launch that Twitter application. So it's an interesting little touchpad trackpad feature right here. And of course, you can see I can move it around. I also have buttons here. If I tap on the buttons, it moves the screen over, uh, as you can see. And I can use the trackpad to move it around. So let me show you how to get this enabled. By the way, as I haven't touched it, you can see it just disappears, all right? But again, for you to see more carefully, it's right here. I'm sure you can see it perfectly. So let's dive in and see how to activate this feature. And of course, you can play around with it. So what you want to do is you want to go to your GoodLock application. All right, so you go to GoodLock, and then you go to the Family section at the bottom, and you go to One-Handed Operation Plus. Make sure this says Installed at the bottom, so it's installed. If not, go to the store and install it, all right? And of course, if you're wondering where to get good luck, all you do is go to your finder, go to your apps, and simply search for Galaxy Store, go inside, and then search for the good luck application right here. All right, you're not going to find this in the Play Store. So you tap on this one, and it's going to be right here. So that's where you get the good luck. And then from good luck, you go to the One Handed Operation Plus. And once you install it, you tap on it, it's going to take you into the One Handed Operation Plus. Now, it's a very complex little feature, but I'm going to just show you the part where you can work with the virtual touchpad. So in my case, like I said, I have the right handle enabled. And you can see a projection right here. So that means I can activate things from the actual right. I can also put it on the left if I want to. So like you can see one we have on the left as well. But let's just keep it on the right. And then what you want to do is you want to go inside. Of course, make sure this whole thing is uh, set to on. All right. So you go to right handle. And then you can see you have a bunch of little options. These are swipe directions. So I can swipe to the, uh, to the left or swipe down or swipe up. All right. And that will allow me to do a bunch of things. Now, as you can see with the straight left, which is this, I have enabled the virtual touchpad at the bottom. Uh, with the diagonal up, which is this and this, uh, I have set them to none. All right. But you can set it to anything else that you want if you so desire. Uh, let me just keep it at none for now. But to set up the virtual touchpad, again, you pick the option that you want. I'm going to tap on this one. You pick the virtual touchpad. And that's all you do. You're done. Now, when you go out, you can swipe over, and then you the, the, the touchpad activates. So that's a really nice little interesting feature, uh, just in case you guys are aware. All right, so a quick video, a quick update. Any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below for now. Have a fantastic day, guys. All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.